Hi, in this video I will try to show you how you can use uh, the MaxBoom Mailer test mode. Um, the MaxBoom Mailer test mode is a way to send uh, emails to uh, your recipient list but in a way uh, all the email actually uh, goes to you, not to the real recipients. Uh, that way you can very easily uh, see what is the result. You can see uh, how each message looks like as if the recipient uh, would receive it, but your recipient never receives the message, only you. How you can do that? First, we are going to uh, launch MaxZoom Mailer. And uh, we are going to uh, write a very simple message with, with some tags, so we can see uh, each message um, customized with uh, each recipient data. For example, here we can uh, write a um, first name, so we insert uh, the tag, a first name, and then here in the body of the message we can say, for, for example, I um, first name um, are, are you today? I hope well. See you. Stan. Okay, so this is very very simple message. Then we are going to select a recipient list. Here I have the several lists uh, I made for this example. We are going to select the first one, sample list. This list has six recipients with each names, uh, company and uh, email addresses. We can even uh, uh, insert the opt one uh, field here. For example, um, uh, this is uh, this is uh, your um, personal reference and uh, we are going to insert opt one. Okay, so now we have the message, we have written the message, we have selected a recipient list, we are going to uh, select the setting in that uh, for this uh, message I'm going to send through Gmail uh, and then we can simply preview the message as usual. So uh, here we have I Adam, uh, I Jorge, I, um, sorry, I have to uh, select, uh, sorry, here we are, I Jorge, I Pamela, I Donald, I Edward, etc. So now if we send, uh, if we click on the send button, the message will be really sent to the recipients. Uh, in order to um, uh, make a test, delivery, it is very simple, we just have to select test mode in the delivery panel or we can also uh, set the test mode here, the menu test mode uh, in the top menu. So uh, as soon as we have selected test mode, absolutely all emails we sent with Max Bobler, we go to a different address, we go to ourselves. No, no email will go to the, to the real recipient, never, never, ever. This is completely safe, okay? So now, test mode is activated. We can see here in the title bar, it says the name of the document. In that, in that uh, moment, it is untitled. And just, uh, just uh, on the right, it, it says uh, test mode. So you can uh, be sure you are right now in test mode. Um, now, if you uh, click on the send button, here, we are going to see that the, the window you get is not the same as usual. You are not getting um, um, a, confi a delivery confirmation window, but a test mode confirmation window. Uh, the test mode uh, window asks you where you want the message to be sent. In that case, we have, we have select pre-selected uh, maxbox at gmail.com, but uh, I have another address for this type of test. It is a uh, test at maxprog.com. I created that uh, mailbox just for that. And uh, you can say to who um, you want to send the message, to all. What, it, what does, it, does it mean? It means that all the lists, absolutely all the lists uh, will be sent to test at maxprog.com. Okay? See, I, see, if I select to first, it, you can select the first one, two, three, or whatever recipients in the list. If you uh, set to sender, 
it will send um, only one message, one copy of the, using uh, the setting panel sender. Not really useful. It is not useful at all when you are using tags because tags are not processed in the setting panel. There is no information about the sender. So the best you can do here is to select to all and select your test email address. Now, if we click on send, the message is sent. Okay. We are send, we are sending to all the list. Okay. We are sent right now. Uh, to uh, six uh, addresses, the six addresses in the test mail list, in the sample list, eh? and all those addresses are actually uh, sent to me. They are not sent to the real recipients. Okay, how we can find out? It's very easy. Now we are going to open, we are going to look at uh, our uh, web mail here, and we can see how all the six email message have been sent to me but completely uh, personalized with each recipient data so i can see how each message would appear to each recipient so here we, we can open a adam and we see how it say hi adam how are you today i hope well this is your personal reference one two three so it is the data we have for adam the same for donald the same here you see, you see donald is 666 uh, and same for Angelin, Jen, Angelina, Pamela, Jorge, Edward, and you, you are, we are, we are the, the, delivery, the, the delivery report. Uh, the delivery report is sent uh, each time we send a message uh, using Max Blue Mailer. So uh, the idea here and is uh, for you to see exactly uh, how a message would appear to the recipient with all the data, all the format, the style, everything but without sending the real thing to the recipient. You, you have a last, uh, the last chance uh, to um, be sure uh, everything is, is going to be, be uh, correct for the final recipient. When you are finished and you are 100% sure everything is correct, you can perfectly uh, de deactivate the delivery mode the same way you activate it. You, uh, you go uh, there, you, say, um, you select test mode again, uh, here in the title, test mode disappear, and here it also is unselected automatically. And then when you click on send on the send button, we are we are we are going to to do a real delivery. So this is, uh, I think, a feature um, that is not really used by people because uh, I believe um, a lot of um, Max Bumeler uh, user not don't even know it exists. And it is, uh, it is a pity because, because uh, it is really, really um, helpful and very handy to avoid errors. There is another way to, to, to make the test, but it is not really as powerful. It is um, placing um, your email address here on the CC or the BCC. But uh, actually, it is too late uh, when you, you are going to um, get the copy of uh, each uh, message. Actually, the message has been sent. You can you can't do nothing. You just you um, can see it has done it has been delivered correctly or not. But you can't uh, undo and you can't undo anything. So um, really, putting an address here is interesting just to have a receipt uh, or just a copy of what you have sent. Nothing else. Uh, I as a reminder, uh, BCC is blind uh, carbon copy. Uh, it is uh, here you can uh, write an address. For example, my own personal address, and uh, here, if when I click on the send button, um, each message will be sent to the recipient, and I will receive a copy. Uh, a blind carbon copy means um, my address will not appear on any either, so nobody will know I actually receiving that email. The same for BC for, for CC, but the CC. Uh, in not exactly the same because the headers will show the address. Okay, so this can be uh, interesting if you want a copy of the real thing, but it is not really for testing. If you want to test the delivery uh, to make sure uh, each, if everything is going as you want, uh, and before sending the real message, best you can do is activate the test mode. You activate the test mode, you send a message to an address, uh, the best if you have a specific address for that, uh, like me, a test at whatever, 
and then you can uh, see on your mail reader, on your webmail uh, system or whatever, you can see how each message is uh, processed and how each data is inserted and whatever. So you can be sure that what you are doing is correct. Okay, that's all uh, you, we can do with test mode. I uh, hope you like this video. Uh, remember, you can subscribe to my channel and you can also activate for notifications. Uh, have a good day and if you have any question, please ask. Thank you.